Hi, my name is Takmar, and in this series, I'm going to give you quick tips how to effectively work with the new Outlook for the web. Are you looking forward to your vacation? I am. Even though I haven't booked my plane tickets yet, I want to be ready for my leave anytime. This is why I want to show you how to set an out-of-office automatic reply today. Let's get to it. After logging into our inbox, we go to settings, we stay in the mail section and continue to automatic replies. Um, to have this functionality activated, we have to turn it on. We do this by clicking on this toggle. And then as you can see, the box appears where we're gonna fill in um, the reply itself. But now first we have to decide um, from what date till what date we're going to use this functionality. So I'm gonna take this box, send replies only during a time period, and I'm gonna put here using this little calendar from um, when to when I will be out of office. Uh, so for me, it's from 20th of June till 27th of June. And then we can continue and pick from these three options. Um, the first one is block my calendar for this period. Um, the second one is automatically decline new invitations for events that occur during this period. And the third one is decline and cancel my meetings um, during this period. I'm going to go for um, the second one, which is automatically declining new invitations. Um, basically, I want my colleagues to know that no matter what event um, is going to happen, I won't be there. I'm going to be uh, catching vitamin D on Bahamas, so I can't um, take part. Um, now it's time to um, be more creative, let's say and uh, to create the replies themselves. Why do I say replies? Because we have two options. And the first one is send automatic replies inside your organization. And the second one is, if we take this box, send replies outside of your organization. So um, the first one basically means replies um, in the company to your colleagues. And the second one is to anyone who wants to reach out to you. So in the first um, box, we can um, create some reply, which will be more friendly. Um, something like, hello, currently um, on my vacay, I will be in the office um, on 27th of June. Um, if there's anything that must be taken care of, please reach out to Peter. Okay. Thank you, Dagmar. So my colleagues will get this reply, which is, as I said, friendly. Um, this very depends the tone of it, um, and the form on, uh, your your relationships um, in your company. And then we continue to send replies outside your organization. Here we're going to go for this one, um, which is thank you for your email. I will be out of the office from June 20th to June 27th. I will respond to your email as soon as possible. In urgent cases, please contact my colleague Josh at, and now we're going to add um, email address for Josh. Thank you for your understanding, Dagmar. And that's basically it. This is how you create the automatic replies. And to finish the whole thing, we're gonna hit the save button and that's it. And so this is how you easily set an out of office automatic reply in the new Outlook. I hope you liked this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel. Also, don't forget to hit that little bell to get notified every time there's a new video. I'm going to have a look at the airplane tickets now. Bye.